G'day, welcome to episode 302 of Trent 365. Today is Saturday the 29th of September. It's AFL Grand Final Day for those that follow the Australian Football League competition where the West Coast Eagles came from behind in the last quarter to knock off one of the most loved and equally most hated teams in the competition, Collingwood. Yay. And look, over the last few weeks, I've had a lot of conversations with younger people, people in their sort of late teens, early 20s, about career, future, that kind of stuff. And they're always asking me what my thought is on education and the need to get a certificate or a diploma or a degree. And my answer is this. A piece of paper tells me you're not stupid. As an employer, it tells me you're not stupid. It doesn't tell me you're smart, it just tells me you're not stupid. It also tells me you've got a certain level of commitment that you can actually finish something, whether it's a one-year certificate or a three-year undergrad degree or, a, I don't know, an eight-year PhD. It tells me that you've got a level of commitment, and those things are both pretty important. What it doesn't tell me is, are you willing and able to do the work? What does tell me that is the part-time job at McDonald's the newspaper delivery job. I know that's how old I am. I used to deliver newspapers on the push bike. Um, cleaning tables in a food court. Whatever those jobs are, those menial type jobs that you can only get when you don't have the experience and the qualifications, it tells me that you've got an understanding of what it means to work. You understand schedules, you understand rosters, you understand uniforms, you understand procedures, you understand teamwork, camaraderie, all those kind of things that are crucial in most jobs. So whilst pieces of paper and degrees and further education are crucial if you're gonna do jobs like doctors, lawyers, accountants, finance people, I guess those jobs, yes, it makes sense that you need to have strong uh, tertiary education, you know, university education, but don't, don't ever put that stuff ahead of, no, that's not the wrong word, the, the right word, don't do that to the exclusion of those part-time jobs that you think are below somebody of your position or your skill set or somebody wants to be a doctor, you don't want to be cleaning tables in the food court in your local, local supermarket. Well, why not? Because that tells an employer that you are actually willing and able to do the work. That's just my thought on education, diploma, certificates versus work. Like to know what you think, let me know. Thanks for tuning in. I will be back again tomorrow. See ya. My keys and my patience. You took my heart, I must leave a decoration. You mistaken my love, I brought for you for foundation.